Think about some of the rarest items to possibly drop on Hypixel Skyblock. Now imagine this. You start a new profile and um, you head over to the Mushroom Desert. When exploring the Mushroom Desert, you kill a few Mushroom Cows and um, you drop one of the rarest items in the game. A Hypixel Skyblock player who created the profile 21 days ago. Level 60 um, with a 20 skill average and a 61 million coin net worth. They have killed 60 Mushroom Cows and they dropped one of the rarest items on the game, valued at between 90 to 100 billion coins. That would be a decent start to a profile. A couple of months ago I actually made a video about this exact topic, and I came to the conclusion that it actually takes over 200 years of real life gameplay um, to actually have an average drop chance of getting this die. But in the end it wasn't a sweat that was grinding endlessly 24 hours a day who actually dropped this die, it was somebody who started a new profile and literally killed uh, just a few cows, just a few. Now they did have it displayed on their island not too long ago, however they actually have the visits disabled because I can imagine there's probably a lot of people who are really interested in this. Considering it's one of one, nobody else has dropped this die and no one's probably going to drop it for a very long time. The item is pretty much priceless. Being a player who's pretty new to the game, um, you'd want to protect yourself and, I, and I'd hope that some people are protecting him because there's some pretty shady people out there who would want to get that die off his hands um, for pretty much zero coins. Before we go any further, if you are planning on purchasing anything from the Hypixel store, make sure to use code NITROS, it gets yourself 5% off. You should subscribe to the channel, if you watch the videos and you haven't subscribed, please make sure to do so. You should join the Discord server, it's linked in the description of this video, we offer slays and dungeon carries, so if you need carries or want to carry and make some coins, make sure to join. Now, nobody actually knew about this up until um, Wednesday this week. I recently dropped a cyclamen die on a new profile. I can't find any info on how much the die typically goes for, um, and all other dies seem to range from between 20 mil to 1 bill currently. After doing research, checking the wiki, I found the cyclamen die is technically the second rarest Aaron Jesus die to drop, tied with Celeste die, and just behind Wild Strawberry. If anyone knows the average price, please let me know. And here we see in unstable dragon armor and no texture pack, we have the cyclamen die. The first responder estimated that it would sell for at least 90 billion, and rightly so there was a lot of people telling him to basically make sure he keeps that die in his account safe. You better not get ratted or something, especially that die, and that's true. Now, to understand why this is so expensive, of course it's because of its rarity. It's a 0.000001% drop chance from a mushroom cow. That equates to 1 in 100 million. And without taking magic fan into consideration, um, that translates to about an average drop time of 271 real life years of constantly killing mushroom cows. I know that some people have tried to grind for this die before, um, but realistically it is complete and utter luck. Something that rare is just crazy to grind for, and is best dropped when a complete surprise. And while the Cyclamen die is its own unique colour, I mean it's a completely different hex to anything else, it's not too different. It's crazy to think that there's probably fairy dyed pieces out there that have a very similar if not the same hex code as well. Now, what I will say is I've grinded for RNG drops in the past, and I've not been too unlucky, uh, I guess in, in relative terms I've been probably quite lucky. But I know there's people out there that are not the same. People who drop 3-4 to four billion coins on dragons to, to maybe get one dragon pet in the end or, or not drop anything at all. The people who endlessly fill meters for warden hearts, judgment calls and then potentially even overflux capacitors too. I can imagine some people are pretty salty at the sight of somebody who's level 50 and just started a new profile dropping something like this. I just think it's funny and it is a massive GG. Now when it comes to the price, um, a lot of people have estimated between 90 and 100 billion coins. I've heard, I don't know if it's just a rumour or if it's actually true, but I heard that they, they were actually offered over 90 billion coins. However, that could just be a rumour being confused with, I guess, some of the comments on the forum posts saying that that's what it's worth. If I had the die, I'd get your favourite Glacite or Lapis set and, and, and just put it on there. I wouldn't, but can you imagine how annoyed some people would be? What would a level 50 even do with 100 billion coins? You'd be spoiled for choice. And we can see here a few of the screenshots that he um, actually put on the forums of him basically being constantly invited to parties and um, when inviting them to the co-op. It is just a bit mental. So many people want the die off him and um, yeah... He needs to be careful. Someone mentioned to him that he needs to watch out and not get ratted, which is absolutely true, and um, he wasn't sure what that even meant, which is a miracle he's not actually being ratted yet. Um, yeah, it, it really is. Um, but yeah, anyway, gladly there's people explaining 
what not to do, which is really nice to see as opposed to, I guess, the other way around. Anyway, I asked the question in my Discord server, thoughts on this situation? Shouldn't happen? Yeah, I can kind of see people's frustration, but honestly, it's just a GG. This is the way that dice work. They're incredibly rare. You could grind it for an endless amount of time and not drop it and just kill a few cows and, and drop it completely unexpectedly. I mean, it's just the way it is. Yeah. GG, man is RNG himself. Agreed. Watch him dye his armor with it. Uh, he, the person who's dropped it is fully aware of how much it's worth now, so I, I don't think that's going to happen, unless he does it for the funny. How do you even get the die? Kind of feel bad because you'll most likely get scammed slash hacked, etc. Yeah, but I feel like there's quite a lot of people now that, he, that he's probably in contact with. Like, on the forums, there were so many people trying to help him because he was obviously a new player, didn't even know what Ratin was, and now I, I feel like he's got people protecting him, hence why he doesn't have his island on public and, and so on. This is why dyes being this rare is just bad. The sheer rarity of dyes often making selling them better than actually applying them to something, which defeats the point of it, um, being a die in the first place. And I, I kind of see, I, I kind of agree with this, and at the same time, I, I kind of don't, because even though they are dyes and their use is to be applied, <coughs> the more, the more, when they get this expensive and this rare, they're more just collector's items. I can see it from both sides. I can see why people might not be a, a fan of the, the system that dies actually dropping and um, what they've become when they're this rare. But at the same time, I, I don't know. I think it's quite fun. He's going to need someone trusted to help him understand the value of it uh, and what to sell it for before he gets lowballed. And yeah, I, I'm, I'm pretty sure he's well aware of it now. No one's going to buy that for 100 bill. And yeah, it, it is just a die and it's probably not going to be applied to anything. And... You might think no one's going to buy it for 100 bill, but I guarantee there'll be people who are willing to make an offer. This is a one of one, one of the rarest items in the game that's finally been dropped after almost two years of it being out. It seems silly to, to us regular folk who don't have the coins for it, but if you've got billions and billions of coins to spare and nothing to do with and you want a really, really cool collector's item, you better just hope that nobody else drops it soon. Um, but there you go. You've got to think why nobody's dropped it. I mean, at this point, it is a one in 100 million chance incredibly incredibly rare but not only is it incredibly rare you've got to think about the type of people who are going to drop this die it's either going to be a really really low level person who's just started the profile in this case like what's happened who's got incredibly lucky and just killed a fraction of the um the amount of you know mobs that you actually need to even get close to being at the average or it's somebody who's going to sit there for hours upon end and grind it because they know dropping this die is a possibility and how much it would potentially be worth. You have no other reason to be grinding those mushroom cows other than to fulfill your beast, Jerry, and that's not going to take too long. But after two years, this, this die has finally been dropped, which is crazy. And out of all people, I'm, I'm, glad, I'm glad the person who's dropped it dropped it. And I really hope that nothing bad happens to the die itself or their account. I hope that they keep their account safe. Um... Not only that, I hope that if they do cho cho actually choose to sell it, that they get a fair price. Um, and I'm sure they will. Anyway, if you did enjoy today's video, make sure you do leave a like, subscribe if you're new, and I'll see you in the next one.